It is Joely Bandiri Tribute Day. Yes, the number 14 jersey, red, white, and black. Oh, didn't he cause some absolute mayhem back in the day? They get it away to Bandiri. He's going to have Barb Dowell goes past him. Dowell Lily tries to stop him. Been knocked forward by Scotland and the referee's given the penalty. Taken quickly by Highley. Trying to create a bit of space wide. Here's Satala with the Deary with him. Oh, this fella can stretch the legs. If he offloads, this must be the try. Wonderful counter by the Barbarians. Their third score in something like 17 minutes. And out of nothing at all. And it's all about space and it's all about pace. And here, here's our play. Robert Howley takes the pat penalty. He puts width in the ball straight away. Ruben Kruger there. Satala sees the break. And Vidiri leaves his wing. Alan Bullock for dead. Alan Bullock, incidentally, number 11 there. He's actually not a winger. He's a, a centre playing slightly out of position, although trying to get used to that wing space. But he lost his man there. And Vidiri showed a clean pair of legs there. Orini IE, in just his fourth Super 12 match, puts his team in front. As Jackson restarts, Joe Ellie Vendiri puts the first tackler and the second. Great strength and balance from the big Fijian winger, taken on by Thompson. Blues rampant in the early stages here. Tacking brilliance, but here's where it started. Yeah, Joe Ellie Vendiri went virtually through the whole of the Chiefs forward pack. Grabbed down by Slade. Now Tanu'u fires it out to Spencer. Straight out to Vendiri. Vendiri on Zubair. Can he do it, Callum? He can't do it, Callum. And Vendiri's off. Sensational try for Johnny Vendiri. Tanu'u, as he's challenged by Kronfeld. Kick bounces back. Lomu and Wilson. Tries to fire it. Duggan gets it. Laney trying to run away from Stenstas. Oh, it's broken down here. Vendiri chased by Leslie. Leslie won't have the pace. And Joely Vendiri punishes the Highlanders. Three minutes out from half time. Holy. Satala. Takes three Scots to bring him down and he's released it. That's nicely moved by Robin Brook. This is John Langford. Jenkins has to go in and Harley. Scott Gibbs, the third member of the Welsh trio. Well taken by Jason Leonard. I'm not sure he's got the pace to go all the way, but this fellow has. And once again, it's Dueli Vadiri who gets across the Scots line and a gentle canter in for the 18 stoner. Well, there was a gentle stroll in, but all the hard work was done earlier on. They found the space here. Look at Jason Leonard here. This guy's a prop. He's not meant to do that, but he gives the scoring pass. And Joely Vidiri just jogs into the line there. But again, great entertainment from the Barbarians there. Away to his cousin, Joely. He should get there. That's another one. Here's a chance. This could be one of the great tries. Yes, it is. First New Zealander to score four tries in a Super 12 game, and what a way to do it. Steve Devine, 15 metres from the halfway line, Auckland's territory, Spencer again, working the grubber for Joely Vendiri, this is dangerous. He's the quickest man on the field, and that is going to be a try. But this guy is good, he's really good. Carlos Spencer, excellent little grubber through. Beautiful bounce here for the Deary. The chip over, well placed. And from here, no one was going to stop the big fella. He's just so good when he's good. Great work, Carlos Spencer. Young up, Darren Juni was locked into position until he let it go. And then this man had the fly. Beautiful thinking. To do it quickly, the execution. Look at that big strong. Nothing can stop me, I'm all the way up. Oh.